guys really, after that first go, y'all, I, th I think you dominated things pretty much, didn't you? Uh, we did have a good effort. I thought we had a real good second period. Um, I thought Houston played, probably took it to us the first 10 minutes of the game. Um, you know, but then we got one on the power play and we had a good penalty kill and the penalty kill seemed to get us going a little bit. Coach, if this is the swan song for this bunch of guys, I mean, that's that's been together these first 36 games, is it, was this a good indication of what y'all been able to do as a team? Yeah, it was. It was fun. Like I like that. You know, there's a. You know, you look at guys that. You know, some guys are thinking of the NHL camp, but they played just as hard anyways, and that, that's just true, credit to their character and who they are, and and uh, you love to see that. You know, you like guys that play hard no matter what, and. I think in the end that pays off for you if that's who you are. So it was good. Lots of guys battled again tonight, and uh, I thought we had real good tempo. You only had 13 shots on goal against you. I mean, Nilstorp had three or four really good saves in there. I mean, keep that, keep it all in the game. Is you got to be happy with the, the defense though overall, right? Yeah, it was good. But Nilstorp did make. It was more than three and four. He probably had eight or nine real good saves, and uh, it's, it was a bit of a strange game that way. If we gave him something, it was big. But uh, he came up big, and uh, you know. It's three one, so if they get one, it's a tight game. So you know he he played real well for us. Can you talk about the effectiveness of the power play over the last stretch. I mean, you guys had some fits and starts getting started, but you guys are really on fire these past few games. Yeah, it's good. Uh, you know, Morin's unit uh, uh, they played together last year, and uh, you know they're a little bit slow starting this year, but they're they're starting to you know to execute real well. And uh, you know the odd break here or there too helps. Uh, you know we maybe got a couple breaks here and there on it, but uh, they were good tonight. Coach, if this is an end of something, you know, offensively tomorrow night would be a beginning for you guys with the, with the guys that are leaving. I mean, you guys feel pretty good about things going forward? Yeah, but it's it's like any new group. You have to, you, you, there's nothing given to you. You have to earn it and you have to show it. So, um, you know, when we have the kind of the, you know, the new mix of guys and somebody has to step up and we have to get different leadership and, uh, um, it'll be interesting to see. Coach, you, uh, you guys that are anticipated to go to the NHL camp, do you feel like they'll be in the lineup tomorrow night and then hold them out on Sunday? Uh, I think there'll be a little bit of mixture of, of both. Some will be out and some will be in still. So, um, you know, I think it's good. I think the guys that are playing, I, you know, it, it's good for them to play and, uh, and then they'll get Sunday off for sure. Anybody that's going up to the camp probably will have Sunday off. And can you talk a little bit about the opportunity that's been mentioned of uh, the entire team stopping by uh, training camp on Monday and Tuesday? Yeah, that's a great opportunity. I think as a player, you want to show what you can do against the NHL players. So it's a great chance for lots of guys. And, uh, um, you know, a lot of our guys, have they've worked real hard for that opportunity. And, and I think, you know, a lot of guys have put themselves in a position where, where they will get watched. And uh, if something happens up top that they don't like, I think they'll get a chance. Thanks, Coach. Okay, thanks.